And hello everyone, we are back after a long hiatus. Jose and I are back. This is the Comic Culture Warrior uh, YouTube video channel. Back in Dreamland Comics, although for how long we don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. And um, back to talk about some of those things that have been going on over the past few weeks. Uh, by your demand, we actually got a comment saying, hey, when are there going to be some new videos? And here we are. So, uh, we're going to jump into a few things all right after the intro. This is the channel. Put down into. I already know you. Put down into. This is the channel. We're back, and uh, it's right after. Just so folks know the timeline here, it's right after San Diego. Um, I went to uh, the San Diego Comic Convention in, to cover the event. Uh, well, really for me, but also to, to com cover it for uh, the Red Eye and do some things. So if you want to see some of the things that I was up to there, just go to my uh, YouTube channel, uh, YouTube forward slash Geek to Me or Red Eye. Red Eye Geek to me. Um, you'll see what happened there. But, uh, nonetheless, it seemed like a lot of shit went down in San Diego. And things have come to a complete halt in comic shops everywhere. Because um, not a whole lot of uh, really stirring product right now. Uh, Secret Invasion just trickles along, trickles along. Final Crisis, uh... When next issue comes up next week. Next week, the next, next issue's due. Yeah. And um, but after all the initial fanfare and hubbub, you know, hey, it's really been uh, no great shakes. No. Especially Secret Invasion. It's. Uh, uh. Well, you were saying, well, how many tie-ins do they have scheduled now? You saw in well, previews. Well, the new previews came out, and they had like the second batch, which is like the next three months worth of stuff and it was like 70 books like 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 60 <laughs> 65 or se to 70 something like that like of tie-ins and, and mini series and stuff like that and i think that's between like august and october or september november or some oh. shit like that i don't know wow 70 almost 70 tie-in books for whatever for an eight issue mini series yeah yeah that's like that's like Secret Wars all over again. Well, Secret Wars no, was company-wide. It, it, it was, but, I mean, back then, the editorial was a little bit better, and, like, the... Maybe maybe Secret Wars 2, I would say. Secret Wars 2 was pretty bad, like, yeah. as far as... Because Secret Wars 2 just kind of sucked. And, like, the tie-ins <laughs> with, with that, you know, is this is... But this is even worse. It's, it's bad. Uh, it's but like, it's, like, in, in... In New Avengers and Mighty Avengers, like... Like, still telling, like, stories that happened months ago just right. to get people caught up. And Did you read The Last New Adventures? Yeah. What? Yeah, I did read. And I'm, I guess I'm going to maybe seem like I'm flip-flopping here, but I've actually been enjoying those New Avengers and Mighty Avengers books because it does fill in a lot of stuff. Though, at the same time, I think it's unfair to those folks who don't read New Avengers and Mighty Avengers, you know, that they have to go to those books to get that backstory that they're not going to get in the main series. Now, did you did you catch um, did you catch in the last issue New Adventures? Um, you know how that's the one which it wasn't too bad because it was interesting in some ways. Was the Skrull Captain America? Oh yeah, that was actually you know, pretty. Yeah, but they yeah. they actually had um, Spider Man in that book. Right. Okay. And remember that uh, was it like Sh um, Shanna like. Right, like, like, cut him to see if he was human. Right, but the Spider-Man that she did that to was the Spider-Man that was in that ship. Did you catch that? Because it was a Spider-Man uh, with the webbing underneath his arm. Was it? Yeah. Well, I gotta catch that. Hold I on. did not catch that. Just talk, and I'll, I'll grab it real quick. Well, because again, I mean, uh, I'll, I'll give Bendis some credit in that the at least the issues with the backstories of the different characters the, the characters have been very compelling and and to me real i, I really enjoyed the hank pym issue that yeah, was boring um 
No, see, this is a Spider-Man, and this is the webbing. Because remember, in Secret Invasion, number one, he was making fun of the other Spider-Man. He's like, oh, I was running around with that costume on. And this is a Spider-Man that has webbing underneath his arms, which is supposed to be the Spider-Man that was in the Skrull ship. And that's the one at the end where Shanna cuts him to see if he's a Skrull, and she says that he's human. Uh, uh, And I don't know if that's just, again, all this could be... Well, I mean... This whole problem I have with this is that editorial is so bad at both companies that what could be a, a pretty big hint, like, oh my god, this might be Spider-Man, could just be because someone fucked up, and someone is always fucking up on these books. But if that's the case, that's like pretty huge that this Spider-Man is the real Spider-Man. And so maybe they can get away with the whole like Mephisto... Uh, didn't like he yeah, did a deal with the yeah, scroll Spider-Man, yeah, so it shouldn't yeah. stand kind of. Yeah, thing. but wouldn't Mephisto know? You, I yeah, I know. Come on, I know. So, but yeah. but that's that's the big that's what I got from this is that that's that's the Spider-Man that was in the scroll ship and hmm. it. Well, I haven't. See, he's right here. Yeah, no, he does. So, well, I haven't I haven't um checked out the uh, comic book resources recently, and a lot of times Bendis does like a commentary on each one, so maybe. Maybe this is old news to everybody else, but I I don't. Well, it know. came out a couple of weeks ago, so yeah. But so. I, yeah, but then again, but like I haven't read anything anywhere online about it. Oh, okay. But then again, I tried to like avoid anything that has to do with Bendis and interviews like the plague. <laughs> so, but I don't know. I mean, if that's a big thing, that's that's it's okay. huge. But again, I don't huge. know. It could right. be just bad editorial. But if it is, then Not, well, if if if. I just, just uh, again, this is all supposition on our part. But if if it is a case where the scroll, it's a scroll uh, Spider-Man that's been living on Earth this whole time, uh, that's that'd be worse than the clone, the clone it would be saga. saga. That would be worse than the clone saga. But again, I I I don't think that's the case. I think that's a case where. Then how would you explain this? The artist goofed up. But they made it a point. They made a point in that Secret Invasion where Spider-Man makes fun of himself saying, uh, you know, what was I thinking wearing that costume with the webbing underneath? That looks so yeah, goofy. but it was a different artist, correct? Yeah, but yeah, but he makes it a point to say that. So you think oh, that... okay. Ed, so it could be something... You know, because like the regular, the real Spider-Man is making fun of right. the, the okay. web underpit uh, right. Spider-Man. Right. And so, but that's like a pretty... It's a line and it's in there and okay. he's making fun of himself, so... I'll have to go back and reread that because that completely got by me. And so, and it's just really difficult to stay on top of these things when the books are really so far apart. And um, it just goes to show that really, this whole, the, all these chapters as they're putting out, really, they're looking towards a trade. Quite frankly, that's what they're doing. They're looking towards a trade, and with that kind of strategy, I think you're kind of guaranteeing that you, people are not going to pick up the 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 pamphlets as they come out in the future, especially if you pace it like this, you know, because yeah. God knows I'm not, I'm getting fed up with, um, the fantastic four, uh, the Miller fantastic four and Wol- and Wolverine. And I'm, I've just decided I'm going to wait for the trades. If that I'm Wolverine was awful. The Wolverine was bad too. So Marvel it's... editorial. Sorry guys, but, uh, uh we're kind of flogging a dead lawyer here. So I'm going to drop this and, uh, We'll talk about uh, DC in the next segment. Be right back.